We love simple decorating ideas that make a big difference in the look or feel of a room. The idea of an accent or feature wall is not new, but it has moved beyond just paint and wallpaper. Kate Spencer from Tile Outlets of America is here to show us how to use tile in feature walls. Welcome. Thank Good you. Good to see you again. We're so yes. excited. So yes. tile is so popular, it has an official day now, right? <laughs> no. I'm not even kidding. Tomorrow is National Tile Day. So that take your awesome. margarita and look at the tile. <laughs> day inside. <laughs> Perfect. I love that. All right, so tile can make such a difference on yeah. our floors, and we've talked about little bits on the walls, but an entire wall of tile. Exactly. I love this concept. And you know, and it's something that we forget about, you know, and we, we always concentrate on our floors and our shower walls, but we don't necessarily concentrate on feature walls. Okay. You know, spaces in your home that really can make a, a you know, a statement. A big mm -hmm. statement. So yeah. you brought four yeah. different types of tile that work oh, really well on walls. Let's start yeah. with ledger. Ledger. So ledgers, you know, are very popular, come in multiple colors, multiple, you know, thicknesses and they are just really oh, great wow. to see. So you can look at that on the back of, you know, behind Ledger. a bed. Yes. How neat is that, you know, and then decorate around it, you know, so there's a lot of different colors that you can get that in. So look if you want texture. light tones, yeah, so you got that texture. Some are deep and chunkier, oh, wow. some are not so much, you mm -hmm. know, and even that in a kitchen with a dark ledger is, it wow. really makes a statement. Awesome. You that's know, look beautiful. at, that's cool. you know, white black couch. in the back and then white yeah. couches. I mean, awesome. yeah. what makes a, the couch pop. Yeah. What a statement. Obviously you see them mostly on fireplaces. This yeah. is really common use for, you know, ledger panels outside. You think of them as doing them outside in facades, but hey, let's bring them inside. Okay, you so know, ledger, show them. ledger refers so to pretty. what exactly? The style of tile? Correct. So it's, it's like a, it's a, it's a stone, so okay. some of them are quartz, some of them are, you know, sandstone. So they're all different granites, you know, mm -hmm. and so Pretty. they're really chunk. Some of them have more chunks, some are thinner. Yeah, so it kind of gives you that little bit of a texture and a dimension. It really looks neat. I know, nice Linda likes the sparkles. The oh, too. I do like I that. Oh, and the sparkles, the, yeah. yeah, the quartz gives you that sparkle, yeah. oh, which is really, would, really nice. That yeah. would make me smile every time I walk in that <laughs> I agree, <laughs> I right. totally agree. Okay, so what exactly is split face? Okay, so split face is taking it down to a little bit of a smaller ledger. So okay. it's a little bit flatter, more dimensional in size, so you don't have you know, different widths and different size. So you can also create that soft look in a room with a split face mm. without it being too chunky. Which okay. makes sense for something like mounting a TV. Mounting a I TV, like that, yeah. putting yeah. it behind glass shelves, you know, oh, so you kind of have a, a yeah. little bit of that deep dimension on it, yeah. you know, uh -huh. and you know, it, it just has a little bit of care. Again, these come in multiple colors and, and multiple different, you know, Design, and so. I like that it's a little flatter, mm -hmm. so if you don't want something quite so rough yeah. looking. Subtle, yeah. 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 But it looks natural. It looks like bringing nature inside. Yep, yeah. and this is this is travertine, so this is bringing stone inside. Okay, great. Now yeah. let's talk about wood. We know uh -huh. we love it on the floor, yeah, but you can use a wood look on a wall. And you know, in the wood looks, you, you know, you mentioned earlier about shiplap. You know, a lot of people are familiar with that term and using right. it, but you know, you can take porcelain planks and put them on a wall and, and make this oh, dynamic I look. That. And I brought this plank with us, so we'll look at that in a minute, but that gives you that look of, you know, what will that look like behind a headboard or oh, as a so headboard cool. oh, that's or gorgeous. on a feature wall? Well, and I would was that's interested in doing this in the bathroom awesome. behind a mirror, but I don't want yeah. the wood in the bathroom with the moisture. Oh. So this solves that problem amazingly, because so many people want that look right now. You do, and, and I think that, you know, you take that texture of that wood, you know, and it's so smooth, and it's easy to clean. Right, mm -hmm. I can and clean you, you know, you're going to be point. able to put that into any area. So that it, there, it's very popular right now. You're going to see wood on back walls. Check it out when you're out and about, because I know it's you're going to so you're going to yeah. see it. In it is. And then you to touch do. it, and you realize it's but tile. It's tile. It's like, tile. Wow. And cleaning yeah. is the major thing. If it won't clean, you're not going to like it. Nothing you can't do with tile. And then no. there's the look of the larger tiles and the bricks. Tell us about yes. that. So bricks again, very very popular. You're going to see a lot more brick looks. And again, bricks are not going away. In the, in the styles of they're changing the colors to make them not as you know brick like they're you know putting color into them mm. now so you can take a wall in a kitchen that's cool splash mm -hmm. up a brick on it and and really make it stand out that's so it neat. really makes a statement in that room and you can create this look again oh, wow. with any different color formats that you have and and I think that's what really makes it creative and, and you oh. mentioned cleaning because oh. again these have a great smoother mm. surface so mm -hmm. if it's a backsplash I'm gonna be able to get the spaghetti sauce off when it's yeah. <laughs> it's so nice to see them all together because when I look at the individual tiles I can't see it but now seeing how right. all, they all come together it's beautiful and tile outlets can, outlets can help you with that because they have designers that work with you so that when you see it like this you can also envision a finished product so check out tile outlets to create a custom look for your home you can find them in Tampa Fort Myers and right here in Sarah
Sarasota on Cattleman Road or find them online at tileoutlets.com. We love to decorate and we're going to find out a little bit more about the history of margaritas when we come back. Yay. <laughs>